Hey guys, it's Felicia with Happily Ever After Living. Today is Monday, September 12th, and we need to talk about yesterday's weigh-in. So this is week six of my 12-week transformation. This will be a shorter video, so I'm gonna tell you guys now, I need your help with the YouTube algorithm. So go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up with the shorter videos, then it automatically shows that there's a shorter watch time. Obviously, YouTube likes it when we watch videos a lot longer or if we're on their platform a lot longer. So if you enjoy these short videos, just thumbs up and give it a comment, like leave a comment so at least there's engagement on the videos and then they'll be like, oh yeah, yeah, she's probably legit. This is probably decent. All right, now we've gotten that out of the way. Listen, like I'm helping you, you're helping me, right? So let's do this. Let's first talk about last. So you guys know I'm currently in week three, I think, yeah, of intermittent fasting. So last week, what I wanna do is share with you guys like my steps and also the amount of time that I fasted. So we're going from Sunday, September 4th through Saturday, September 10th. All right, so on Sunday, September 4th, I got in a total of 3,605 steps and I fasted for a total of 25 hours. Now, let me tell you why. Part of that was because we, like we had a lot going on on that Saturday the day before, but then Sunday was also like our family reunion and I wanted the ability to eat whatever I wanted and I sure did. I tore up some ribs, oh my gosh, so good, they were so good. Yeah, and like I was just able to eat whatever I wanted to eat without any guilt at all, so I really appreciated that. But because I was fasting for a longer period of time, I did not do a workout that morning. So I only got in 3,605 steps. Monday, I had a total of 19,202 steps and 20 hours of fasting. Tuesday, 15,006 steps and a total of 21 hours fasting. I do got, want you guys to remember, whenever I break my fast, it is with a lot of yummy, good, good food. I actually show you guys when I'm done with this video, what I'll be breaking my fast with today. Um, on Wednesday, I got in a total of 8,185 steps and a total of 17 hours fasted. Um, Friday, so on Friday, no, 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 okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I skipped Thursday. On Thursday, <laughs> listen, listen, if you're not paying attention, stop the video right here. This is the funny part. So on Thursday, I got in 2,521 steps. Okay, so that was a really busy work day, lots of driving, a very stressful day. You guys, guess what I did? After seven hours, I broke my fast. <laughs> and I can't even say that it was because I was hungry. Like it was truly just having like this craving for, I just wanted something. And do you guys know, no, you're never gonna guess. You will never guess what I broke my fast to have. I stopped at Dollar General and I had some flaming hot Doritos, <laughs> don't judge, and a pickled sausage. Yes, it was so good, oh my gosh. Oh, it was so good. Like, I want you guys to know that even though I am doing intermittent fasting, when I get hungry, I eat. Like, I don't, I'm not like, when you hear me say I fasted for 20 hours, this is not a 20 hour struggle, it's just, I'm fasting, my body's in a fasted state, and I'm not hungry. If I get hungry, I am going to eat. Um, so yeah, and again, I enjoyed that. Oh, and a Diet Coke, which all of that was like $6 or something, oh my gosh. I think I felt worse about spending, spending, I think I felt worse about spending the $6 that I did having the Doritos and um, pickle sausage and Diet Coke. And that was like in between patients too. So I just really enjoyed that and I was able to finish the rest of my day. I was just feeling so good, I was. Um, Friday, I got in 12,492 steps and I fasted for 20 hours. And then Saturday, I got in 18,871 steps and I fasted for 16 hours. So not bad at all and to be very honest, Usually I wear, I wear my watch like whenever I'm working out to track my steps and sometimes I forget to put it back on. Um, and I do tend to wear it whenever um, I'm working so that whenever I'm with my patients like I can tell them how far they've gone and you know all that good stuff. They love it. Um, so yeah, let's talk about last week's weigh-in. You guys know I weighed in last week 
at 224.6. 224.6. And you guys know the lowest weight so far on this journey, on this 100 pound weight loss journey, has been 222.0 pounds so far. And you guys know my goal for this 12 week transformation is to get under the 220 mark. Yes, I'm like taking this thing into chunks. But anyways, listen, I am proud to say that we're doing it. <laughs> I weighed in on yesterday. Here we go, I'm gonna put it here. I weighed in at 222.0. Cheers! We ready. We ready. Okay, I'm being very silly, but I am officially back at the lowest weight on this weight loss journey. Gee, confetti. I am so proud of myself. I am very excited. And I will tell you guys that I'm a little nervous, but let me tell you why. Sometimes when I hit these new low weights, subconsciously, I start sabotaging myself. But so far this week, I feel that I have a good plan. It's a busier work week, but I am doing a minimum of four miles per day and a minimum of 16 hour fasting. So, as long as I can stick to my goals, let's do a quick body shot. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rising the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new So, I will also say that last week, I started to feel more lean. That is the goal, I want to lean out. Yeah, so that is all I have for this video. If you are on a weight loss or wellness journey, please leave a comment down below. Leave your channel name. I would love to support you on your journey as well. And then also thank you again to all of my new subscribers and for everyone else, you guys have been rocking with me for the longest and I appreciate you so much. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys. You saw how high my foot got? Yes, you know me. Never gonna what? look back. Bye. Never gonna look back. Built to last. You move slow when I move fast.